Ruby here from Casey's Corner and today's video I'm going to share with you what Real Techniques brushes I bought. I never bought a Real Techniques brush nor have I ever tried a real one. Um, so this is going to be the first time I'm going to be using them. I've never tried them yet so I kind of am a bit curious and excited to try them out. So let me show you which ones I got. I obviously um, looked up some reviews about them before I bought them and so now I want to try them myself and they're still in their packaging as you can see. So the first batch that I bought was the Real Techniques um, Your Eyes Enhance Starter Set. I've seen so many people use these and I was like I have to try them out. So obviously they come like this in this little cute package. Um, this is so cute that they actually come in this little pocket over here which just um, has a little velcro strap and you just, there you go, you have your little pouch with all the Real Techniques brushes which is I think adorable. So this set comes with these five eye brushes and they are, let me tell you which ones. So you have the base eyeshadow one which is I'm guessing this one right here. It's really nice and soft and smooth and fluffy and I cannot wait to use that. And then we have the deluxe crease brush which is this one right here which has like a pear shape sort of um, and it's really cute <laughs> um, then we have the accent brush and this is used for it says on the package it is used for spotlighting precision detailing highlighting and smudging I don't know I've never used these brushes before so I cannot say and like me I kind of confuse brushes I kind of use them for not what they're actually meant to be used for then we have the pixel point eyeliner brush which is a really tin pointed brush and then obviously we have the brow, the brow brush and this is kind of really cute and it, I think it's easier to use a brush which is like shaped like this for the eyebrows I always use my e.l.f. brush, so it's not like this, definitely not like this. So I'm excited to use these eye brushes. Maybe I can do like a makeup tutorial just using these brushes right here. That's just an idea. Comment down below if you like the idea. I love the packaging of them and they have the real techniques over there and they actually, oh, thank goodness they have what they're actually supposed to be used for. Yep, the Lux Crease Brush. Yep, they, all, they also have the names on them, sorry. I'm really excited because I've, you know, I've been seeing so many reviews on these brushes and I never use them myself, so it's very exciting for me. <laughs> okay, the next um, brush that I bought was actually, I had ordered a blush brush, but instead I got this stipple brush. So I said, you know, why not keep it? And then I just end up ordering another brush brush. So basically this is the um, your Finish Perfected Stippling Brush right here and it is used for our dual fiber stippling brush is a trade secret for creating airbrushed high definition results with all types of makeup so this I would guess it's used for um, foundations and um, it's so soft like literally it's like so soft and smooth and the, even you just you just feel the brush it is so it's easy to grip and it's just, I think, easy to work with. So that's the stipple brush, got my hair. Um, then we also have, I also got the powder brush. I've been wanting to try this powder brush for so long because I only use the e.l.f. Kabuki brush for powder, but now I'm gonna be using this one and it's so cute, isn't it? It's just, wee! <laughs> I'm so excited to use this and like, bam, this is like a big brush and it's easy to grip again. And the, 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 the little bristles are so cute. I'm so excited to use them. So then I also got the blush brush. And again, I've heard so many things about this. So I'm like, I have to use a blush brush. I love how it's like pointed. And I'm, you're probably saying, Kezia, what are you doing? Why do you have like a fetish with them touching the brushes? It's just, they're so soft and probably so smooth on your skin. I don't even want to get them dirty. <laughs> so that's the blush brush. And then I also got the sculpting brush which is this one right here and I love, I love this because it's shaped really well to contour really well like you can do it over here over here over here here and here so I cannot wait to use that as well 
And then finally, I also got the foundation brush because I wanted to try out something else besides the e.l.f. stippling brush. And, but is this really nice foundation brush? I really love that they have what they're actually used for so it will remind me not I'll just forget so those are the brushes that I got um, I'm mostly excited to use the powder brush and the blush brush and the eye brushes and all of the brushes basically so maybe I should do like a tutorial on me using all these lovely brushes and I can tell you exactly how I felt with them but I just wanted to share with you what I got because I never bought um, real techniques brushes so maybe if you can give me any like tips on how to use them and like if this brush works well example with foundation or this brush is not good for foundation you know um, I would really appreciate because I've never used these brushes and I don't even want to get them dirty because they're so like gorgeous they're like so pretty so yeah, those were the brushes that I got. Today's video was short and sweet. I hope you liked it. Um, if you liked it, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more. Don't forget that I post videos every Wednesdays and Saturdays and to follow me on my Instagram, Twitter, and all that jazz. Thank you to everyone who has supported me in my channel and I'll shout out to everybody in the world. <laughs> um, so I'll see you all later guys and have a lovely day. Bye.